guys it is Monday morning starting up my Monday morning video with some coffee this morning we are getting ready to head out to Walmart let me make sure yes I've got some water in there to clean that out um, so I'm gonna take a scuro pod it's a double espresso so I'm gonna pour a double shot of espresso I'm tempted to just go to Starbucks but I'm not going to today all right while that is pouring I am gonna go ahead and find my crock pot down here and put some chicken on So I just got some frozen chicken, Walmart. I am going to pick up a grocery order, but of course they are completely out of chicken on the grocery order. So I knew I needed chicken for my meal prep today, so thankfully I have this in the freezer. So I can get this done. So I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and put this on high because it's already 10 o'clock, so that way it'll be ready by the time I'm ready to meal prep. I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna do all of it because there's only four and a little tiny piece of chicken. Okay, I, do, I would typically do chicken broth in here and I do not have it. So I'm gonna do some water and then I'm just gonna season it. And just do it that way. So I'm gonna season it with this everything seasoning and then I'll go ahead and do some extra garlic powder. And I'll go ahead and do some onion powder. And I'm gonna let this cook on low for a few hours. That way, I can get my meal prep started after we get home, after I get the kids done for a nap, hopefully, so I can get my meal prep done for the week. All right, I've got my double shot. I'm gonna add my Fairlife protein shake. This is 30 grams of protein. If you're on WW, they're three points a piece. So I'm gonna add the whole thing to this. And then I'm gonna add just a small splash of this um, Cold Stone Creamery Sweet Cream. And then that gives it just a little bit extra. Um, and that is my coffee every single morning. And I'm a little sad because I've only got one more of these after today. And the Walmart grocery order is out of them. So hopefully I'll be able to find them in the next couple of days so I can have more. Um, but that is my coffee today. My three point coffee. So I'm going to be doing like a maybe a little grocery haul. I just got a small grocery order because we are leaving for vacation at the end of the week. And then um, I also am just kind of going to be sharing what I'm eating today, I guess. And then I'm going to be meal prepping as well. Meal prepping some lunch today. So I thought that would be like a what I eat today slash grocery haul slash meal prep type video. But now I'm going to put the top on this. We've got to head out. I've got to go to the pharmacy real quick. Um, we got to head out to the pharmacy to grab something. And then we're headed to get our groceries. And then we'll be back to put all that up and hopefully start meal prepping as soon as that chicken gets done. So Rian's putting everything out for us. Thank you, Rian. Setting everything out for our little grocery haul. This is going to be a small grocery haul this week. You know, like last week, um, I did a pretty large Aldi grocery haul. And so we've got some things left over from that, like snacks and stuff. I also went to Sam's Club over the weekend. We didn't get a lot at Sam's Club. We got laundry detergent, trash bags, applesauce, a watermelon, couple more things. I can't remember what else we got there. Um, so we did do that. So just things that like I didn't want to get too much and then we're going out of town Saturday for the whole next week. And so I did not want to get anything that's going to go bad. Um, so that's why I kind of stuck. And we've I'm trying to think of what we have on going, what we have going on this week. I know there's a couple days that um, we're going to have busy days and I'm not going to cook. And so all right, super quick grocery haul we're going to do. I got I thought I think I only ordered one of these, but they gave me two, or maybe I accidentally clicked two of them. We're going to do like an ACP. I don't know if we'll do that tonight or maybe tomorrow night or sometime this week. So I got stuff for that. I got the rice for that. I'm going to use, by the way, this is from Callan's breakfast this morning. I have not cleaned up. I'm going to use these for, I think I'm going to use these for my meal prep this week. And then I got mushrooms for the ACP. I got some dry shampoo and then the some flossers. This is just what the kids use each day to floss their teeth with. I got an onion for ACP. I got a thing of grapes. These are for my meal prep. Um, I wish these were a little bit bigger. This one's a really good size. These are pretty small. We're going to make it work though. Um, we got some bread. I got some coffee. Let me tell you all my little coffee story. So I placed a grocery order like 10 o'clock last night. So this morning I realized they substituted. This is the only kind of stoke that I buy, but they substituted this. They were out of this. So they gave me the purple one of the stoke. So when she brought it out to my car, I'm like, hey, I don't want the purple one. Y'all substituted it. So I just want to take that off. 
hold on just a second. I, said, I just want to take it off and I just won't get any this week. She's like, oh, which one did you want? Because we just restocked some. And I was like, oh, I usually get the green one. So she said, let me go. As long as they're still there, I'm going to go uh, replace it for you. She said, we just restocked them this morning. So she, it was, I thought it was so sweet for the grocery, for the worker to do that. Go back in the store and replace it so I could have this kind. Um, so I got some of that. We got a couple baked potatoes. I thought if I can find some chicken at a different grocery store, I might do grilled chicken this week. Um, either way, I'll make sure those get used. I got some milk, some cheese, pe turkey pepperoni, uh, cream cheese. I got these for the ACP night. This is my favorite, our favorite cheese dip. Um, we needed some more PB and J. I also got some eggs, some green beans, some salsa con queso. Um, I, my grocery order. Walmart has not had these on the grocery order. Um, but they just started carrying them. They have them in store, but they have not had them an option to get on the grocery order. But I went ahead and got two of them. I thought we could bring one on vacation with us. We got a few of these for Callan, just to have on hand. Some drinks, some French toast sticks. We got some more shredded hash browns for my breakfast this week. And some juices for the kids. And that is just, that's our little small grocery order. I am getting ready to take my vitamins today. I wanted to thank Kara for sponsoring today's video. I'm going to grab a pack of vitamins out and go ahead and take my vitamins for today. So this is what they look like. It has a little challenge each day. Today's challenge, have your favorite thing for lunch today, which I'm meal prepping. One of my favorite meal preps for lunch today. But anyways, this is my vitamins that I take every single day. So if you've never heard of Care Of, they are a subscription service that ships high quality personalized vitamin supplements and powders to your door every month. And you go online and take a quiz. So that way you know what um, vitamins you need. So for me, I have a little card here that I'll show y'all that the vitamins that I take. So it's a 30 day supply. I take fish oil for heart health because I do not eat fish. Probiotic blend, vegetarian collagen for my skin health. I take prenatal vitamins because Callan is still breastfeeding. Um, and then vitamin D. So those are my personalized vitamins every month. So the packs are made from a plant-based film that are actually compostable. Um, but these are my vitamins that I take every day. I'm gonna go ahead and take these and tell you a little bit more about them. They're actually made from clean ingredients. Then you know that they're, they're good for you. They're the highest of quality, um, which I, it's really important to me to make sure what I'm taking is of good quality, especially I'm on like my health journey, trying to get healthier, continuing to um, just get, get my body healthier. So I know it can be overwhelming trying to find the right vitamins and supplements for you, but the good thing about Care Of is their quiz makes it super easy to go on there, tell about your lifestyle, tell about your goals, um, that just makes it completely customizable to you and your needs and what your body needs. So I'm gonna leave the link below where you can go take the quiz and see what products are recommended to you. I have a discount code Haley H. We'll get you 50% off your first month of Care Of, so I will leave all that below the link to go do that um, to, see, to see what vitamins and supplements you might need. All right, I got some of the groceries put away, but I have not had breakfast. It is 11.30 and I know I'm going to eat a late lunch because um, I have to meal prep and get all that ready. So this is my breakfast. This is going to be my breakfast all week. This is my breakfast last week as well. It's just zero points. I don't count the ketchup. Callan! Callan's over there eating his breakfast. I don't count the ketchup. So eggs and hash browns are zero points for me. All right, so I've got my oven preheated to 350. I'm making stuffed peppers from Sweet Savory and Stuff. I've made these one other time. It's been... A few months I shared it in a meal prep video and I loved this meal so much and I have not made it since it is definitely one of my top favorite meal preps I love so many of her meal preps though they're so good um, so I'm gonna be making this again today this is gonna be like I will leave for vacation on Saturday um, but I and I'm going to stay on track all through the week and then when I'm on vacation I just take the whole week off of tracking anything and eat just whatever I want on vacation. We get ice cream every night. We eat out. We just whatever I want I eat on vacation and then I get right back on track when I come home and that's just how I do it. I just enjoy myself for the week and so uh, today I'm going to be making this. I'm trying to look at my measurements to get all these measurements right. So we've got some chicken cooked. I've cost for about four cups. I don't know if I have quite that but I'm choosing however much I have. 
Um, also calls for sauce verde. Also calls for some sh shredded cheese. I don't know what was on the counter that I just some water or something. Shredded cheese. Um, light cream cheese. Uh, we've also got three bell peppers. We've got some onion powder and some paprika. All right, so we're going to do a half a cup of the salsa verde. We're also doing four ounces of the cream cheese, um, which is about half of this container. So I'm just going to do that. All right, so I'm going to do three ounces of this cheese. And then we're going to do some paprika. and some onion powder. All right, so I'm gonna take this mixture and I'm gonna pour it into the chicken and kind of mix all of this together. So that's what it looks like. We're gonna give all of this a stir. So I did spray my pan. I'm just got a small pan because they should all fit. And then I'm gonna take my peppers. Add them to the pan. And I'm gonna add all of this filling equally to each one. All right, I've got all that added. I'm gonna add a little bit of cheese to the top of each one. And then I am going to put these in the oven and bake these for about 45 minutes to an hour. All right, so while the peppers are cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and get started with the tea sides I'm gonna do with them. Um, we're gonna do some canned green beans because green beans are one of my favorite veggies and they're just super easy to do and I just love them. So we're gonna do green beans and then we're gonna do, I got these um, baby Dutch potatoes. So I'm gonna cut these like in half. Um, yeah, I'm going to cook these up in my air fryer with just some seasonings on them. So super easy sides. I always stick, I always do, this is really easy to my, let's check on them actually. So th that was super easy to do as well, but um, just really easy sides and zero point sides as well. I might add some cheese on top of these. I did get some cheese on my grocery order today, so I might, maybe, maybe not. I can't decide yet. Um, we'll see what I decide. So I'm going to chop these in half and put these in the air fryer and then add a couple things to my green beans. All right, so I'm gonna add some olive oil spray, give a good coating of that in here. And then I'm gonna add some of this everything seasoning to my potatoes. This is like my favorite seasoning to go on like potatoes and stuff. So give that a good spray. I'm gonna, I'm gonna spray it again. Give them a good shake. And I'm gonna let these cook in my air fryer for about 20 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes. All right, so I've got two cans of green beans. I drained one and then I didn't drain the other and I've got a little bit of Worcestershire sauce, a little bit of soy sauce, some garlic and some pepper, garlic powder and pepper in here. So I'm gonna let these cook up. These should be done in the next, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes I'll take those out and then these are cooking up. All right, y'all, potatoes look so good. These, I, they were like 15 minutes I left them in. And then these look really good. I'm just doing five days worth. I'm just doing five days worth of meal prep. So I'm going to do five of them and then I'll split the last one up. They're three points each. I'm going to leave them at three points because I can also take a point away for the veggies, but I'm just going to leave it at three points. So I'm going to split these up. They look so, so good. I'm gonna split the last one up between like the smaller pieces. Now I'm just gonna split all of these potatoes up. I'm gonna equally divide these. These are zero points for me, which I thoroughly enjoy that. So I am gonna do about a point worth of the salsa con queso on the potatoes and then lastly I'll put a scoop of green beans in each one all right guys so this is my meal prep this week three four point meal prep and then also I will add a little bit of um, a little bit of the bolt house farms ranch on top so probably a point of that worth of that so I'll count this whole dinner as uh, five points. I could probably, I could totally take a point away from that for the veggies if I want to. 
um, but five points, maybe four. I'll decide each day what I'll what I want to do. But um, this is my delicious meal prep this week. Okay, I'm starting to prep some dinner. Um, so I'm just sharing y'all breakfast, lunch, and dinner today. I didn't really share snacks, but I did have a rice cake with laughing cow cheese on it, and then I also had to take a cup of coffee, and that's all the other like snacks I've done today. But I've got. Hold on. I've got this yellow rice. I always cook this in my rice cooker and it does great in here. I'm hungry. You're hungry? Okay. So I've got all of that. I've got two cups of water and I'll give that a stir and then turn the rice cooker on. Hold on a second. So I'm just going to give this a quick stir. And then this cooks great in here. The only thing I would say is when it's done, like when it flips up and it's kept on warm, take it out or it kind of like burns like the bottom. Uh, but then I've got all my spices here. I did go out and get some chicken and it was on sale. So I got that um, mushrooms. I've got my onion I'm gonna chop up. So I'm gonna e do equal parts, onion powder, garlic powder, paprika. Millie's over here starving. Oregano, chili powder, and a little bit of salt and pepper. Um, so I'm gonna do probably like a half a teaspoon or about a teaspoon of each um, of equal parts of that. All right, chopped up my chicken. All my veggies are in here. All my sauces. So I'm gonna bring all this out and Ethan's actually playing with the kids outside. So I think I'm while he's doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and get all this cooked up on the Blackstone. Little bit of oil, put all my veggies down. Got my seasoning, and we'll sprinkle just a little bit on here. All right, and then we're gonna put this down so they can like steam. All right, we're gonna do some chicken. Nothing smells better to me than these veggies right here cooking. Oh, they smell so good. Mushrooms and onions mixed together. All right, so we've got our chicken. I want to add the rest of her, most of that. Okay, I'll spread that around and let that cook up. All right, so I have um, about a cup of rice. I'm gonna add some veggies for zero points. I did add a little bit of oil, but I'm gonna cancel that oil out because of the veggies that I'm using. And y'all know with WW, you can do that. Um, some chicken, and this is a really big plate. And then I'm gonna drizzle some cheese dip on top. So I have about a cup of rice, which is nine points for this rice. And then I'm gonna add just a few points worth of cheese dip. And I'll count this as about 12 points for the amount I'm using. So that is dinner tonight. It is like, what, like probably my favorite meal that I make right now. It's so good. So I usually do it either this way or I've also shared like a quesadilla style way that I make it pretty much the same just without the rice. All right, we are cleaning up from dinner. It was delicious. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed coming along for my day and my meal prepping and kind of what I ate today for my three main meals of the day at least. Um, don't forget to check the links below if you guys want to check out Care Of and go take the quiz for their vitamins and I'll see you guys soon for another video. Bye.